day four. I'm actually out and try to get my hair washed since it's so breezy. A little uncomfortable riding. Feels like gravity is like pushing down on my chest, so it really hurts. So we'll see how, how this goes. I'll get back with you. Hey everyone, um, back from my haircut. Kind of got in the house and got settled, got my pajamas on, looking real good. The hair washing went really well. I didn't get to my regular uh, hair salon um, only because the one we went to is like faster. So they were a little rough. So I'll be honest with you, it even being in a salon chair laying back, it still jogs you around a little bit, but it's worth it because my head feels so much better. So yeah, just keep in mind it will still hurt a little bit. Um, today I've had a little bit more pain than I have been having. I think it's just because of the pump being gone. I didn't show you this earlier, but my pain pump actually came in this little pack. And what they did is once the pain pump was empty, you now use it for your tubes. All your drains that are coming out. Um, so I have like four little drains in here and I'll show those at a later time. So it's kind of nice because we just like have it pinned up here and it just stays on your waist and it doesn't, you know, itch you because it's on the actual cloth material. This thing that they did get me, it has ruffles on it and it kind of rubs a little bit, but it's okay. It doesn't bother me too bad. Um, I wanted to show you this. I actually got this from the hospital. They give you like a care package for people that's had double mastectomies and um, due to cancer or whatever and they actually give you two of these and they're really nice because when you're riding in the car you can put your seat belt over it and it protects it's small it's not real bulky so you can kind of put your seat belt over it and it just kind of hugs you um, so nothing rubs and that's such a blessing and also at night when I have both of them I put them underneath my arms to kind of raise and support your arms because after a while you know your arms just get really sore from hanging in that whole area where the where the drains are it just gets real tender after a while Percocets today have been a, a have to um, I even got a little nauseated right before supper not sure what that was about I think it's just it's just everything in the body just trying to get used to the trauma you know to your breast area so I took a thinner again and that did help a lot so yeah I'm just honestly I'm just ready for bed ready to at the sack and hopefully sleep for about nine or ten hours um, before I get up and do all this again with your medicine. Remember antibiotics I have to take four times a day so I think that doesn't make your stomach feel too great neither um, and the you know the painkillers are one every four hours is about what we've been doing it and I'm finding that it's really important to kind of stay on that because once you get off it gets out of your system it takes a little bit longer for the pain to go away and it does help with this cream I'm having to put on my nipples. It does help with the headaches. So um, if you're having to put that cream on you, make sure you take a per Percocet because it'll, or whatever painkiller you're given, because it'll help that headache go away. Um, and that's about it. So we're going to kind of close this down tonight and um, join me tomorrow, put another video up, and we'll see how tomorrow goes. Thanks, everyone.